Star Wars special. Starring Mark Hamill as Luke Skywalker, Harrison Ford as Han Solo, Carrie Fisher as Princess Leia, with special guest star, Beatrice Arthur. Welcome back to Star Wars Jedi Knight 2. Dark Forces 3. Dark Forces 3. Yeah, Jedi Outcast. There, 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 there you go. go. Oh. Um, <laughs> I should learn how to I, I want to clarify much. something. At the end of the last episode, I said, shut up, Han. Whoa. And uh, that was not a sign of disrespect. It was an inside joke. Oh. Like we were talking about with me and my mother. Yeah, so if you're thinking Groucho's an asshole son, he's not. <laughs> but I do, do constantly funny. rip on my mother. Do, yeah, that's what you do. Yeah. I think a lot of people don't get the relationship between a mother and the, the son. Yeah. A lot of people think like the, the mother-daughter relationship is like they should be friends yeah. or friendly mm-hmm. and like talk about certain situations yeah. with their body when yeah. that happens. But when you're young, boys are sometimes always a mama's boy. Yeah. Mm-hmm. And then as they grow Ooh. up, your mom mm-hmm. becomes like your confidant. Yeah. yeah. Becomes like a really good friend that you can just like yeah. hash shit out and just talk about yep. fun stuff. Mm-hmm. But it's so different with, with the daughter, I think. It's mm-hmm. gonna, uh, oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. The, it's the reverse with the daughter and the like, Because the there's various, there's various um, mental complexes yeah. that go along with those different relationships, right? Right. Because, like, your dad is, like, someone you... Shower with. Yeah, you shower with. <laughs> you, you know, it's like, it's, it's, your, it's your reference point of what being an adult man is. Yeah. Mm-hmm. And what you kind of measure up to. Yep. So there's, like, a complex there. Same it's thing. It's the perfect thing to... Mother-daughter s- things. To relate or to try to yeah. size yourself up to. Mm-hmm. Yeah. You're not and sizing then, yourself up to your mom. And then mother son is just like you know she's the you know she's the caregiver. She's the you know where you feel comfortable, where you yep. feel safe, mm-hmm. right? She was the one that gave you food from a very young age. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Like my dad's my buddy. Like we joke around, we hang out, whatever. You know my mom's a, the, the mommy. You know what I mean? Would you feel more comfortable talking to your dad about certain situations than your mom? Yeah. Over the years, I've gotten... 100%, yeah. 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 But it's just because knowing their personalities yep. and how they 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 both process things. And it's just, I know with some things, my dad's going to be the better one to go to for certain ones, and my mom's going to be the better one to go to for other ones. You know what I mean? That makes sense. Just because yeah. it's... Oh, yeah. it's Yeah, because of how our relationships are and based off of what... You know, how I know my parents as people and what kind of, you know, roles, you know, parental roles. This one feels more like a dad thing. This one feels more like a mom thing. Mm -hmm. Do you think, because we're dealing with Star Wars here and Star Wars is all about family. Yeah. That's the crux of the whole series is Mm -hmm. family dynamics. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Has there ever been a time where both your parents had to sit you down? Yeah talk to you about something oh hell yeah oh yeah i don't remember what be it like a grade thing or a grade thing or or they caught me lying about something or something but you liked you enjoyed showering with your dad (laughs) but that my my, but that they had sat me down and you know talked about do you like usually though usually though now that you now i think more is like usually it's like one or the other usually like bullshit look at this Usually both don't, you know, sit me down. Mm-hmm. Maybe once or twice that's happened. You know, make, maybe me, a couple times. and my brothers, we had to have fucked up pretty bad for both of our parents yeah, to sit us down. Right, exactly. Did one is usually they sit down more. Oh, uh, I see. Rob. Sean is being the good boy. Yeah, I was mostly the good boy. Yeah, I would, I go, I would spots, go Rob, though. Steve, Sean as far as who's been sat down most. Yeah. Steve hardly at all. Yeah, except for uh, when he was like. Steve had like a full fledged like Diablo two addiction. Yeah. Like he and, and wow, and it got he's, to the point where he's my got parents got wild hair about him sometimes. Yeah. Too. But my parents took his uh, door knob away, so he couldn't lock himself in his bedroom but all he, day. Yeah. But he, the door knobs away. He was also yeah. the youngest yep. too. He was also so the there's youngest. that that thing as well, because that's me too. I'm the youngest, so I'm forever the baby. Right. Mm-hmm. Um, especially since me and my brother are so far apart. Me and Sean are middle boys. Age-wise. I think I already have. Oh, shit. 
Pew 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 and then, and then, uh, you know, you respond normal. Your mom's gonna think I'm being mean. I'm gonna take your side. <laughs> and I was just like, yeah, 100%. Yeah. And it happens every time. My dad can never win if it's a thing that's me and him. Mm -hmm. Because I'm the baby. Mm -hmm. It's always gonna be what it is. Mm -hmm. And he knows it, and we always joke about you it. You always, you have that, that power, uh, or that, that dynamic. It's always, even though my mom knows my dad and I's relationship and how we joke with each other all the time. Yep. And we'll, we'll take little digs at each other as a joke. She'll always be like, you know, she'll, still, she'll still be like, Kelly, stop it. Yeah. <laughs> like, that's not nice. That's be, and we'll be like, it's, I'm like, it's fine. It's like, fine. This is what we do. It's, Every single time, this is what we do. This is men stuff. Yeah, whoa, we whoa, joke. Whoa. We don't, but she doesn't, but that's the thing too. She doesn't understand that. She's always being like, maternal. She's like, uh, she doesn't understand the thing with dudes. Well, banter is just kind of And natural. dude friends where they are constantly ripping on each other. Yeah. And whatever. I'm like, that's just, that's what we do. It's fun. Yeah. It's like, I don't, it's like, it seems me. I'm like, it's not. We know when it gets mean. <laughs> like, yeah, it, it's literally just banter. Yeah. It's just fun. Just if making things jokes. Get out of hands, then, you know, you, you, know, you apologize. Then it gets addressed. <laughs> yeah, it gets addressed. <laughs> Usually, not a problem. <laughs> But yeah, so that that's the that was, I know she doesn't understand that because it's not you know it's not it's not a it's not what she thinks yeah. friends are like you know no. what I mean I was like yeah. but that's what it is I think yeah women like to do things behind each other's backs well they they take it more personally they take it way more personally they hold I don't grudges, want to generalize women here but they hold but, grudges as I'm speaking from my family yeah uh, my family I would say they hold grudges the women internalize. In the family, the women in the family hold grudges way longer than yeah. guys do. But guys will get really bad at each other, and then like ten minutes later, like be like high five and drinking a beer. Pretty mm. much, that's me. But and it's, bros. it's 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 because it's different ways of of cool. dealing with things. Yeah, Not, everything doesn't have to more, be like a, a big, a little more personal. From what I've experienced and seen, again, I'm not trying to generalize. Uh, it seems to be more personal oh, with am. women I'm generalizing with with of. with the women i've known Fair enough. <laughs> seems to be more personal with dudes it, if it is personal it gets called out pretty quick yeah it doesn't fester too long they might no. hang on to it for a little bit but and it's always when it's when it's guys because that's why guys because comes us from dudes, a, us dudes internalize everything else <laughs> it comes from a place of like things. brotherly love too yeah it, it doesn't oh, yeah. come from a malicious spot unless no. you have like an actual Villainous yeah, friend, intent. douchebag. Yeah, yeah. If, you, if you're like associating with douche, douchebags that are just constantly there just to rip on you for ripping on your right. sake. Because mm -hmm. it's always hey, it's always you. been a, a big hey, well, thirty three with personal experience. Our friend group, accuracy. our friend group is always Quads. that's what we we rip on each other all the fucking time. Yeah, and, and we understand. There's you know a couple times may may have gotten a little tense, but then it gets walk. smoothed over pretty quick, and then we're back to talking shit about each other. That's just what we do. We know it's not personal. It's just who better to talk shit about you than somebody who knows you? I know, <laughs> right? Mm -hmm. Because you can because you know you know the thing that'll cut them too, that'll get yep. them, and they know that. Yep. Some of you may have noticed in earlier episodes where uh, there's like you know uh, when we were playing Street Fighter a long time ago. And then I was just getting Wilson all riled up. Oh, yeah. It's because I know that that will do it. Just <laughs> like button mashing? Yep. Or just and, and being very blase about it. And then like winning and stuff. And then I was like, yeah. Or I'll make little comments here or there. There was one, I don't remember can, what I said. You can really get under remember. his. Because yeah. uh, <laughs> we know each other so well, right? Yeah. Um, we, uh, I forget what the comment was, but I said something like just a small little picking comment because I knew and it did just like just like ah. just a blow up yep yeah. and I was just like this is what I don't take it so seriously this is what I yeah because it's not it wasn't <laughs> that's anything. where you were going room yeah yeah trying not to take this seriously I'm just having a good time I know and and and, and you, you can know push those like, buttons you can push them because I know in fighting games sometimes Wilson gets a little serious he gets competitive which is fine it can be yeah which is fine yeah I have nothing wrong with that but I, I'm just sitting here chilling and I'm just like I can. I get the same way too. Is like, yeah. I don't like losing. No, nobody does. But I was just like, 
Who does like Knowing music? the fact of how I'm, little, be little I play damage. video games, period. Yeah. And when I did play video games, how, like, little I invested in, like, getting certain techniques and things down. Mm -hmm. I know I'm not good. So it's like, losing's like, whatever. Yeah, C -stick. Dude, I fucking love C-Stick. Full <laughs> tilt. Um, <laughs> and that's, that's another thing I know gets under people's skin, and I'll, I'll fucking... I'll, I'll point that out quite a bit. Where we'd be playing, I was like, oh, just see sticking to victory, guys. That, <laughs> that's why I fucking changed my my tag on on uh, on Smash Boys. On Smash to C Stick. That's my tag on there. Mm -hmm. So it's 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 that little thing just to kind of pick a little bit. Yeah. It's nothing personal. So do you get C Stick? C -stick I just like, That's the and that's part of my personality too. Is I like, do you get C Stick? Do I get do I get C Stick? <laughs> Well, you know, uh, the, or the, the rare occasion Broucho does actually kill me in that game. Yeah, it's yep. a C stick. Hey, yeah. dude, I'm a quick, I'm a, I'm a straight murderer in that game. Sometimes. <laughs> no. Sometimes sure I murder everybody. If we did everybody. Uh, best of five, I'd, I'd kick and that, him, and that, I'd yeah, probably, him. and that, and that, that's also a thing that brings me joy. One of the things uh, that brings yeah, me that's joy that's is picking at people and, and, and getting little reactions out of them. It's because you're a little brother. Yeah, you're little exactly. Ass. I'm a little brother. Yes, 100%. Especially since my older brother was eight and a half years older. Like, we couldn't, like, fight. He couldn't obviously. punch you. Oh. Yeah, you know what I mean? He'd punch so a was, hole in and, and, I, and I knew that, right? Did he ever, like, so I would, take advantage I would, and, like, actually, like, scream at the you? The one time, one time, well, he'd yell at me. Yeah, I mean, whatever. It's Did he say, like, he, like, punch you and be like, if you say no. mom, I'm going to hit you harder. There was one time I kicked him I in the nuts, I did that to my though. brother. There was one time I kicked him in the nuts. <laughs> yeah, the uh, straight-up classic, like, oh my god, oh my god, don't tell mom, don't yeah. tell mom moments. Yep. I, uh, I kicked him in the nuts one time. Perfect. And he was in, like, high school. Sorry, not sorry. So I was, you know, he was a teenager and I wasn't. And uh, he knew he couldn't do anything to me, but he had balls in, his, you in his anger and frustration, he just picked me up and power bound me onto the couch. Oh, which was fine, fine. right? Yeah, it but he be. could get his, you know, blast of anger out there. Yeah. Did you give him a hell yeah, brother? <laughs> <laughs> there was another time too. He had a pink eye, and I had like my toys out and I was playing with them. My mom's like, "Now, Ryan, don't you know? Be sure not to touch Eric's toys so he doesn't catch it too, right?" Uh -huh. And then I heard that and so started like digging. playing in his face with them and shit and just like being a douche and then he uh don't um, tell Bradshaw not to do something he'll do it and then he mm -hmm. and then my brother got frustrated and then he just jumped forward and just laid all over my toys and like rubbed them all around it was hilarious <laughs> nice but yeah so <clears throat> yeah so I'm a I'm a tish bit sadistic I guess Good You're words a right there. Holy shit, sick bit. back. Like, Tish bit. Holy shit. Where's Not fully. I don't like bye bye. I don't like seeing my friends hurt. <laughs> you know what I mean? I don't like seeing my friends hurt, but I like seeing them a little annoyed. Yeah. <laughs> it all comes from Bradshaw's way of uh, showing that he loves you. A lot of the time, yeah. A lot of the time it's if it's uh, I think you're doing taking something too seriously. Yeah, true. That's when I do it. Cuz I I just want to chill and, and have fun times. Yeah, yeah. sometimes it gets kind of uh not fun when everybody else is having like serious moments of mm -hmm. focus mm -hmm. and you just want to like break up that and be like guys let's just go for a bike ride or yeah. something what goes in the hole comes out the hole <laughs> it's your first one yeah and your last one because that's their episode hey. that's the last one and the first one last one and the first one we'll be back with more Star Wars Jedi Outcast mm -hmm. we'll take with this elevator it'll be super exciting yeah you know the fun thing about an elevator most of the time. You go in the hole that the elevator is. On the Star Wars special.